Hello, welcome to episode five of the Thrive Themes tutorial, where in this video we're gonna share how to create a, a page on your site. So what we've been doing, we've been doing a Thrive a tutorial playlist on getting to use Thrive Themes. I think it's fantastic. We've shown how the benefits, installation, the, the dashboard. Now let's get to actually creating some pages. So um, I've installed like Thrive Architect, Thrive Leads, Apprentice and Optimize. I've got the theme. This is the this is my blog at the minute, lifesuccessengineer.com. You can see I've been I've been using it for some time now. Um, I've got landing pages. I've been using the Optimize. I've been using the Apprentice. And this one in this video, I just want to share with you how to create a page. Because if you're going to start creating your website and start going with this, you're going to have to have different pages. So when I go to the Life Success Engineer um, blog, you you can see I've got. Uh, the home page then I've got like courses. I've got online arbitrage services. I've got about me section about Kev I've got the blog. I've got the consulting. I've got a contact. I've got support. I've got um, Resources and I've got a, a million dollar brand case study. Okay, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna Let's say you wanted to create a page. Okay real straightforward on the on the left hand side There is pages you would go to add new Okay, this is sort of just the add new. Um, this would then go onto the um, the WordPress section of add new. I highly recommend at this point that you do install, you know, Thrive Architect because Architect is great when it comes to when it comes to building your um, your pages. So let's just say uh, this is the Thrive Themes. Um, tutorial page okay thrive Thief tutorials you can see here i've got the the launch with thrive architect which is the important bit um you can see on the the right hand side all these are still the same the publish i can um make this public now i can publish immediately there's the yoast seo all the things that sort of are on um wordpress but what I'll do is I'm just going to click publish. So I'm going to publish this Thrive Themes tutorials. Okay, I'm going to publish this, and then um, what we're going to do is we're going to start building the page. We'll start building the page out. Okay, so if once this once this reloads, I'm going to go through the process on building what we can call the Thrive Themes uh, tutorials page. Okay, because Essentially, that's what we're doing in this playlist. We're going to be creating this this entire sort of playlist, this entire sort of um, the ultimate guide to to Thrive Themes. So that's this is probably going to be a page on the site. So what's really really good about the Thrive Architect once it loads up is on the left hand side you can see you've got elements and the elements it's it's so it's just drag and drop. That's the beauty of it. So when I look at the home page, when I share with you the home page, and you may want to think about your own home page, it's all sort of drag and drop. The images, the animation, the the text, um, where I've put the buttons, uh, it's just all drag and drop, which is really, really, really useful. And you can build these pages so easily now, um, just using Thrive Themes. So what I'll do here is, hopefully once this architect uh, loads up, it's because I think I'm Re, I'm, I'm also recording through screen. Um, here we go. So you can see here, this is just a blank page. So this blank page has got the it's got the the title of the page. You can turn this off very very straightforward. So at, down at the bottom here, you've got Thrive Themes options, display options. You can hide this. You can show this. You can do the breadcrumbs if you wanted. The feature images, the display buttons. It's got some Thrive Theme options on the on the edit page section. So if I wanted to, um, let's say I wanted to start with an image. Okay, I wanna start with an image. I can drag and drop. I can go straight to the uh, the choose images. Um, I can add any of these. I don't know, let's just say I wanted to use uh, this one here. This is Thrive Themes, okay? So the ultimate guide to using Thrive Themes, let's just say I wanted to have 
a title here. So we're going to have the ultimate guide to thrive themes. I can drag this. It's so, so easy. I can put this as a heading one if I wanted. I can underline this. Now I've got um, the image here. Super, super straightforward. Let's say now I wanted a column. Okay. I can put columns. Let's say two, half and half. Then I wanted a, I can put a, I don't know. Let's say I wanted some, uh, let's do a social share drag that above here so they definitely want to have some social share on here I can put a paragraph in here I can put sharing is caring I can bold this fantastic so then let's say I wanted to have a quick introduction okay so welcome to the ultimate guide to Thrive Themes, Thrive Themes. In this ultimate guide, you will learn the following. And then I can put, I can list, I can, that's basically what I can do. I can do episode one. Episode one was the Thrive Themes. Thrive Themes, it was like the overview slash review. Episode two, this is how easy it is to build out. So I'm gonna end up building this um, just for the sake of it, um, because I, I'd wanna share this. I wanna share how to use Thrive, Thrive Themes because I think it'd be really, really useful. Uh, then let's say I wanted to, um, there's a lot of things I can do here. I can do sort of a background section. So this background, if I wanted to put a background as in like image or um, a color, you know, I could do that. I could apply this really, really straightforward. Um, let's say I wanted to uh, do a video background. I can do that as well. Um, really, really straightforward. There's so many different elements that you could have. Um, I'm most likely going to go for something along the lines of listing episode one, episode two, episode three, or just putting videos in. So I could put like a video here. Okay, so this video, that could be, before we put that video here, we could put like, let's put how, let's put episode one, Thrive Themes. themes review and overview okay so then I can put the the video in video straightforward I could use a YouTube video I can do a Vimeo video I can do a custom um, code really really straightforward um, I could put some custom code underneath so let's say um, let's say I wanted to what I tend to do is I, I tend to have sort of um, Watch the video. Watch the video below. Okay, you can very easily sort of duplicate any of these by clicking that button. And then I want to have a podcast as well. Okay, I could have a podcast episode. Uh, listen to the podcast if I wanted to you know this is more sort of a on-screen tutorial so it probably wouldn't make sense to to do an, a listening episode but you get my point and after some time you can build this right out so if I show you the uh, the millionaire um, the, the million dollar brand case study uh, you can just format it exactly as you want this is one of the uh, the landing pages where it, you've got a button on there now so that's what Thrive, uh, uh, the architect, allows you to do. It's super, super, it's awesome. So you can see here, this is the, there's some animation here. You can see the animation, you can add all that. So let's say I wanted to put some animation on, the t on this picture. I can scroll down, animation, I can have it come in, animation slide from the top or from the left. I can loop it, 
I can add it directly to a Thrive theme, a Thrive um, Leads box. I can link it directly to a website. There's a lot of things here that are super, super straightforward. And that's how you build this out. You can build this out. So let, let's say I was to click on, um, I mean, this is a blog post. So I'm going to show you how to, to build out a, a, a like a, a blog post, but it's on the same principle, really. Um, I'll show you how to lay out a really good blog post in the next one. But that's what you want to get using. You want to use Thrive Themes to start building your pages out, depending on what pages you need. So if you wanted courses, if you wanted about you section, if you wanted the blog, you're going to want the blog. You, if you wanted a support section, a resources section, you can start building all these out super, super straightforward, takes no time whatsoever just by using Thrive Apprentice. And then you can save this, okay? Save it, get using it later on, and it makes a big, big difference for you. So um, give it a thumbs up if this has been a useful, um, you can preview it, okay? So let's say I wanted to preview this straightforward. Um, give it a thumbs up, love to know what you think. Continue on the playlist with me, uh, get using this. Um, there's gonna be a link in the description below which is gonna show you, um, gonna use the link towards and, and get access to Thrive Themes. The membership is fantastic and um, yeah, um, I'll see you in the next episode. If you're interested, get into the Facebook group, get into the the the, the, the free course, all in the, all the details, link in the description below. This is Kev from LifeSuccessEngineer.com, inspiring you to take massive action and I'll see you in the next episode of this Thrive Themes tutorial.